Yo guys, so what is going on? My name is Quick and welcome back to another video. So today in the video, I'm going to be teaching you guys the best and easiest high ground retakes to do in Fortnite. So a lot of you guys asked for a part four. So I decided to just come on Fortnite and record this part four for you guys since everyone wanted one. So before the video starts, make sure to drop a like and subscribe and turn on notices as well. It does help me out a lot and you guys can never miss a future video if you do turn them on. All right, so without further ado, let's get straight into it. So the first retake is something I do really often. It's probably like my main retake. And you guys actually might know this retake from my other videos. By the way, if you want to check out my other videos, there'll be a playlist in the description. But yeah, basically this retake is something I do really often. Um, and it's something really easy to do, but it's just super, super useful in 1v1s. It just helps you out so much, stops people from shooting you down and stuff like that. So. What you guys want to do is basically be in a ramp position. What ramp position means is basically you need to either be in a single ramp position or a double ramp. It doesn't really matter. But once you're actually in the ramp position, you want to make sure to put a cone and a, a floor above your head when you're running. From here, you can either jump left or right. I prefer jumping left. It's just more natural for me, just flicking right and flicking left. So what I do from here is I basically do this. I jump to the side, place this wall instantly first, just to stop people from taking a shot off on you. And then I'm landing under this ramp. This gives me like protection from the top. So from here, what I do is head out of here, put a cone and a floor once again. You can also put a wall here. This is help. This is protection more of the enemies on the right. But you want to edit through here, put a cone and then edit out like this. So yeah, that's basically what the retake is. It's something really, really simple. Uh, there's many different ways on how to do it as well. So, all right guys, so now I'm gonna be showing you how I actually do the retake in full speed. So running up, I wall off, and then I just go to the side. This is really useful, just to like juke out your enemy. So um, they're gonna probably think you're gonna go straight forward, but you go to the side. From here, I like to just, uh, just do some other retakes. So this basically works with double ramps as well. If you guys like are in a double ramp situation and want to do this retake, it's also really easy to do. So you want to basically just double ramp up, cone and floor. I usually like editing a cone like this just to make them think I'm going to go through the cone like straight forward. But I basically jump round and then I uh, go to the side like this, edit through the side. And then I just maybe do it again or maybe like a, a few more times. So that's basically like what I do. You can always turn around, just get a nice easy shot. The main tip most people don't know about 1v1 is that you just need to like outsmart your opponent and just like weave in and out of his his or her builds. Like that's mainly like the tip I give to you guys because basically when you do 1v1 you don't want to single ramp really far because that's just really easy and they can just easily cut you off. But what you need to do is just like weave in and out of people's builds. So say for example, someone's got like a like a tower like this. And then you're at the bottom like over here. Instead of literally going up like this to them. Because they can, they can easily see you and just shoot you out. What I prefer doing is probably like going like like this. Doing some like weaving types type stuff. You guys get what I mean? So they have to look at different angles each time. Because like if they have to look at one angle for the whole time, like if they can just look here and just shoot you, then it's really easy for them to actually like pick you off. But if they have to look here, then you transfer over here, so they have to turn here. And then you go over here, so they just have to take their time to actually stand up and then aim a different location, you guys get what I mean. Alright guys, so now I'm going to be showing you a high ground retake that which involves peace control. So peace control has been getting really popular recently and this retake is really, really useful and just outplaying your opponents literally every single time. So that basically works is um, you can either double ramp or single ramp again, it does not matter. But what you guys need to do is jump to the side of this cone and then paste a, a wall and then a floor straight away. From here you want to edit a window and then paste a cone. If there's an opponent on top of your um, cone, they're going to get boxed up like this. And you're just going to have, uh, you're going to take that whole box and just be able to shotgun them like this. Take easy shots. 
like that. So basically, this is something I've done so many times. I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play like a really quick clip on the screen right now of me just outplaying someone with this technique. So you guys, this is really easy to do and it's just something super simple I decided to just include to help you guys out. Alright guys, so now I'm going to be going on to the next retake. Uh, this is, this retake is basically you want to start by ramping up once again and then you want to basically put a cone on the floor. From here you want to edit the side and then instantly place a, a wall. From here you want to basically edit the wall into like, into like this kind of shape. I mean, it doesn't really matter how you edit it, you can edit it like this, you can edit it like that. Um, I prefer doing this. From here you want to put a cone and then instantly edit the cone. And then from here you want to um, put a cone on top of the cone you edited and then put walls around. From here you can, um, you, I like running up here, just placing a, a floor and then uh, editing this. And then once you actually get out, you can do the, the retake I showed you at the start where you, where you do this. I actually realized that using a floor instead of a cone is actually way more consistent. So what this basically looks like is this. So you Alright guys, so now I'm going on to the next retake. Uh, this retake is done by a lot of creative warriors and just people who just do creative stuff. So what you guys need to do in this um, retake is basically you want to start by ramping up but with a cone instead of a ramp and then once you've done this you want to edit through these and then instantly put a floor on the cone down make sure you're actually on the side of the cone like on this side instead of standing in the middle because if you edit the cone like this you could fall under it so yeah make sure you're actually on the side from here you want to edit the cone into a ramp put a, put a cone on the floor above you like this and then you can just repeat the process of just doing this and just editing up like editing your way up this is like i've seen a lot of people do and it's just super super effective it's kind of like a spiral it looks kind of like a spiral you just keep going up up round and round that's basically what it looks like this is super easy to do um i guess it's not that protected because if someone's like behind you they can easily take a shot off on you but it's something really efficient and just something that doesn't use too many mats and it's just an easy way of just getting up on height. All right guys, so the last and final retake I'm gonna be showing you is something that I've seen tweaks do so much. So this retake is really easy to do guys. This is done by quite a lot of people now. A lot of people know about this retake, but no one really uses it that much. So what you guys wanna do is either be in a double or single ramp position. Um, if you're in a single ramp, it's gonna be much harder, but double ramp is easier, but in, like, you can still do it in single ramp though. So, so what you guys want to do is once you're ramping up like this, you want to do with 180 and then place walls around you like this. And then from here, you want to put a cone instantly and then a wall. Uh, say someone's ramping up, they go inside your box and then you basically place this, which basically blocks, blocks them off. So you want to edit through here and then place floors and walls everywhere. From here, there might be an opponent inside your box. So you can just take an easy shot up on them. They're never going to expect it because like, you just literally just box them up like a fish right there. I'm gonna show you how to do it again. So you basically uh, 180 and then you cone and then you take a shot. Hope you guys enjoyed today's retakes. Um, I know this video uh, wasn't too good, but I'm gonna upload like content videos now. I've got so many good video ideas I can use. So make sure you guys to stick around turn on notice and just subscribe also like the video just help me out a lot thank you guys so much for watching my name is quick and i'm out peace